<laughs> so, my name is Jordan Michael Whidbey, and I'm co-directing this show. My name is Amanda Ray, I'm playing Frida Yobert. My name is Darian Torbert, and I play Man or Errol Philander. Chris Shea, and uh, I play The Policeman. My name is Emily Harvey, and I am directing Statements. Statements uh, after an arrest under the Immorality Act. Uh, the complete name of the play is Statements after an arrest under the Immorality Act by Athel Fugard. By Athel Fugard. I'm almost embarrassed at how much I love it for how recently I've read it. Darian gave me the script uh, after Emily had given him the script. I was like, yes, how can I see more? How can I read more of this right now? Let's do it here. Let's do it now. And so the opportunity to work on one was, was very enticing. This one is just a lot of stuff, and it's powerful, and it's it's just so much in a short show, and it, that's what I love about it. I think it's a play about the loneliness of institutional racism. The Immorality Act, basically, it's, it's a law that says any kind of interracial relationships are illegal. A law that prohibited the... Uh the mixing of races in the bedroom. Like a bedroom Jim Crow. And it's about how systems are set up to alienate people and to really pit people against each other. Uh, specifically, blacks and whites should not have any sort of intimate relationships, or really relationships at all. Frida loves Errol because Errol is everything that she didn't know she needed in another person. You get to see all of the love, all the togetherness, and then you also get to see the heartbreak of everything getting torn apart. The last two pages, I think, are the most affecting piece of theater I've ever read. And when I read it, I cried. The reason I wanted to do this project was the people. The people involved in this show are uh, people that inspire me in so many ways. Uh, I also think it's pretty cool that um, Loving vs. Virginia, well, 50 years ago, it passed, which is important to me because my grandparents we're interracially married in 1958, so it's a story that resonates. And as I think about like my family, how important it is that things like this happened, like um, Philander and Frida getting together, uh, I wouldn't be here without stories like this. It's pretty dope.